Hey, it's Ray the Beat, and I'm here. These are my favorite shoes. I'm about to do um, a show and tell on what I like to wear and with them, my music and stuff. Do you see um, waterproof Timberlands? So I'm rapping in the background. That's me rubbing this thing in the background. All right, all right. I'm gonna play a song that I did um the other day. Oh, 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 oh,
singing to just now and this to be uh unmixed and unmastered but i do mix and master my own music that's like you know engineering music but it's still you know this to be right here and uh all right and we gonna uh show and tell i like to wear the fashion when i do my music videos and stuff soccer I wear cleats when I'm not playing soccer I wear cleats for fashion and I'll be stepping in the cleats you know um, they my like uh, they're, they're my shoes that I really like that I really wear and um, I play basketball I play soccer I play baseball and I play the drums I play the drums and I play the electric guitar. I play the piano, it's over there in the other room. And um, I like all the instruments for the most part, so I'll be always shouting out to the tarp, the harp, the violin, and so I'll be talking about how we be leaning our ears to listen to the music that we do out here. I'll be talking about how we, uh, we be rhyming and stuff. I'll be talking about um, you know all that in my music music videos and even you know right now when I'm just you know we just chilling and stuff and I'm about to organize and stuff I'm gonna put this uh, I'm gonna put this away too and so um, I'm gonna put stuff on here so I can put it you know away but um Alright, so we 
got this vest. I like vests and stuff too. And this one is. It's in Indo British garments. And I like this a lot. Um, I like it a lot. This one of my favorite. You know, everything really is my favorite. Like I always say that every time I put it to the camera, this is my favorite. It's uh, uh, I'll be serious about it. Like I'll be wearing this stuff over a lot and so. Uh, I think that I like thermals. I like the plain thermals, and I like um, like the stuff that has nothing on it. And I also like the ones that got like Ralph Lauren polo right here. So I got a few of the Ralph Lauren polos that I showed on part one. This is part three. They got uh, lots of deep. Uh, I like these right here. Um, and I got some that I like them that you know these shirts that um bigger and I got a few that's smaller like this then I got like you know the regular you know uh, t-shirt they got the polo sign on the uh so Levi Polo and uh Ralph Boyd, Levi and True Living True Religion and uh Gucci and um Versace and Ferragamo and uh it and um MCM is my favorite and so um my favorite backpack and my favorite uh my, my I got all types of stuff. So this right here, I got this. Uh, uh, I like this right here, and I show a different backpack the other day. And this is my favorite, and um the True Legend backpacks is my favorite, and the MCM backpacks is my favorite, and the Louis Vuitton backpacks is my favorite. Um. Uh, my favorite to play for real is the electric guitar. This is the electric mandolin, which is similar to the electric guitar. And um, I'm I'm lightweight fascinated with the uh, the harp, you know, the big old uh, strings and stuff. And so I'll be playing that one day soon. And I actually play the flute. So every time I'm doing the instruments, I'm freestyling. So every time I'm doing the instruments, I'm freestyling. When I'm rapping, singing, I'm freestyling. So that means just, you know, I'll, you know, I shout out to all of us, the folks and the ones that know how to read music and know how to like write music as far as music notes for the instruments. Particularly, I don't even know how to read that type of music. I actually tried before um, and I just, you know, but I was enjoying, you know, everybody that was around that, that, that area when I was, uh, you know, trying to get in that area. But it just, I like to freestyle a lot and I like that style too. So freestyle is just, you know, going at it with the strings without even thinking about it. And, and, and I'll be rapping and singing without even thinking about it. But when I say not thinking about it, I'm kind of thinking about it, but I'm saying like, there's no words or notes in sight. You know, I'm pulling it from my mind, my words, my rhymes, just getting there. Just like right now, you know, I'm speaking and, and, and interviewing about things that I wasn't even thinking about before I got on camera. So I'm very random when it comes to the camera. You know, I'll be going somewhere and I'll say, you know, I'm gonna get on camera right now. It's night time to get on camera, night time to do a dance move, some dance moves, and my dancing be freestyle. So I shout out to everything. I shout out to, you know, uh, the chore chore choreography of folks that really know how to, you know, remember moves. Me, particularly, I even tried that drama, like, and it just, I, I just, uh, you know, my attention span, you know. Uh, uh, so I shout out to the ones that, you know, pick up on things and know how to retain the information. Me, I particularly, you know, have to, uh, you know, stick to the selective, because I'm a selective music uh, puzzler, you know what I'm saying? So, some of my, say my say all of my sayings is originally my sayings, but some of them I do like recycle my, you know, my sayings. Like I'll say, you know, I'm a rapper singing, 
I'm, I'm a rapper singer over and over again in every song, you know. Uh, it's really repetitive and you say, man, I heard this trillion song from Ray by Ray and Ray saying we this and us and the islands of the glances of the lands and it's us lands, our lands, is lands, the islands is, you know, what it do, you know what I'm saying, and landing with the landing gears of the ground to grounds, rooted roots. And so that's how I rap. And so I would say all of that again, but totally different with a lots of t different words that I never said before. So like even the sayings that I, you know, re reiterate and be articulate with saying it again, but different with different words, putting different, you know, saying the same thing, but different ways. Grabbing words and phrases and sayings that I've never said also within the things that I've already did so I can be the guider with the guidelines of the, you know what I'm saying, this is the, the artist right here, they say this a lot, but when you hear that song, all these songs, I'm going to say something that I've never said before. And so, um, I use, when I say freestyle, really am freestyling, you say, but I heard this uh, sentence that you said before, but it's my original sentence and I want to stay consistent, consistent with, you know, this is Ray, you know what I'm saying? This is Ray, this is Ray Beats. I say, you know, Ray making the beats. After I said tons of things I've never said before. So I come back and say something that I did say, so you know who this is, you know, putting timestamps on your lingo, on your, you know, being of togetherness, but the individuality is always creative. So even what you like to wear is always fashion is just, you know, you in general. So I like to wear lots of plain stuff because, because uh, I like to, I like to put my name on things because again, that's just a part of the artistry, but I, I like to, uh, you know, uh, again, say, you know, this is Pottin' Ray, you know, I'm Ray, and, and I do music, you know, there, so, and I dance and stuff. And so, with that being said, the beat is in the background that I did make, uh, lots of beats that I did make, and so this is also all about, you know, again, what I have for, even behind the scenes, if I didn't do a video that day, you would say, you know, um, Wow, you know, that's that's some of the stuff Ray be wearing when we see, you know, uh, when we be hearing the music, because I do audios too, I, all the time, you know, uh, I do videos of my music and also I do audios, so you be like, oh, that's the stuff that you be liking to wear and stuff, and so um, I do, you know, I'm saying, like to share behind the music, behind the scenes, behind the producing and directing an artist an artistry you know and so being self is artist being self is art the art forming is automatic to you know what I'm saying be self so I shout out to the self knowing self mastering of just you know knowing self is knowing other folks so that is a part of my speech and, and, and even my music is a part of my speech so I've always told myself you know I am here for the youth we are youth, we are youthful, and so I use that within my music, and, and it's useful to, you know what I'm saying, gravitate to the falling words like a waterfall. I always, you know, have metaphors, puns, and punctuations within my, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, this is uh, Ray's music, we, we know this is Ray right here, and so I shout out to all of us and how we be the beings that, you know, like to do what they do. So I like to do music, and I'm gonna share what I like to, uh, you know what I'm saying, have around. Even, you know, just saying, you know, I play soccer, I play basketball, and, and putting that in my music, and putting it, placing it places when I do turn on the camera, even outside, everywhere, um, I like, you know what I'm saying, let you know who I am, who I is, you know what I'm saying, on the is lens, who we are, is is immaculate, splendid, spectacular. So the spectacularness is everyone, all of us. And so I always talk about the all, which is everything, you know what I'm saying, which is us. We everything, we everything. And so I mix and match the lingo for my mascot, my character, the characters and the characteristics that we do have within one trait, one avatar, 
it's all of us that is the avatar, so it's other folks playing soccer, it's other play, placements that we go in and we like to be at. So I like to be in the gym as far as on the basketball court. I like to be at the you know goalie field. I like to you know be fulfillment with the filming. And even off the film, I'll be saying what's up, and we like to say what's up, and so this is me saying what's up, and so, and, and all that, and so, um, and yeah, part of so film. This is part, this is part of three of, uh, now, but I've got all type of parts, one, two, three, four, five, of me doing this, you know, our entire, you know, our existence, we like to, you know, number of things and so I got plenty of videos out there that I numbered you know one two three four five six seven eight and all that but like in the now 2024 of me you know showing this what I like to uh, wear as far as right now and stuff it's just stuff that I've been liking to wear and gravitating to like this is being me you know uh, as far as this being us you know but the thing about it is, is uh, in the now this is part three, but you can catch all type of my interviews, all type of my musicals, and and, 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 and all that out here, out there, you know, everywhere. It's, uh, yeah. Parts of this hat happens to match with the backpack, which I'm happy about. Back there, I showed and I shared um, what it was, and I pulled it up close and showed you all that in part one and two. Um, and then, so these right here is some khakis, and they are Callaway. C A L L A W A Y. And I like these a lot because it got like a little pyramid, it got like a big pyramid thing right here. I like, I like the, uh, my favorite shape is the, um, you know, the triangle. And so I really am fascinated with the triangle, the pyramids and stuff. So I put that in my music and so I put, you know, what's my favorite animal? My favorite animal is the, uh, the lions and stuff. And I, I stick, you know, um, my favorite color is turquoise and foam green and, and teal, you know, like that, you know, like that type of stuff. And, uh, and so, I, 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 uh, what else? My favorite number is five. So them Levi's, I like Levi's a lot, I said that, and so that's what I'm rocking right now. I'm rocking Levi's right now too. I like Levi's. And so lots of time I got on here showing like what's new that I got, and so lots of my stuff I'll show in one and two. This is stuff that I've been had for the most part. And I'm just a goofball, I'm a goof, I'm a goof troop, right? And so this stuff is nice, but I'm showing stuff that, you know, I've worn like thousands of times already in part three. So if you want to check out part one and, and all that in part two, that'll be cool. Although the stuff that I wore 20,000 times, it's good stuff, obviously, because I'm, I'm showing you, and I, and I still want to wear it. It's <laughs> so this actually, this still crisp, you see what I'm saying? This still crisp. So some of this stuff, it's going to be all wrinkled, and it's going to be because, I mean, I rarely, <laughs> I rarely wash. Like, 
I'll go weird like some, and I'll be like, well, yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah. And so again, there's another a plain thermal right here. And this stuff, half of this stuff is still semi-new, I only wore it like, some of this stuff I'll probably, you know what I'm saying, had to wash a few times or something or still do, I don't know, but for the most part, I know all these clothes are clean, it's just look a little wrinkled. Some of them look a little wrinkled. This actually still looks, this one look semi-crisp and semi-wrinkled. That's who I am, right? And so, but when I first get stuff, it should be cool, right? So when I first get stuff, I, when I say, you know, I wore stuff 5,000 times, I mean, when I first got it, I didn't want to take it off. And so, and then I'd probably, you know what I'm saying, mix and match it with something else later, but, oh, um, yeah, all right. And then, oh, um, here's another thermal. This one is, this is the one right here. This one is, oh, um, Sonoma Lifestyle Thermal Henley, perfect for layering. So this one is a thermal that I like. So don't get me wrong though, I do like the crisp. I like to be, so this one crispy like for real. All type of nice crisp, you know, stuff. Crisp stuff is back there too. And so as I'm showing this stuff, it's all, you know, unzipped and stuff and so let me zip this stuff so it can look more you know flattering and, and more appeasing to to the eyesight but i mean you know again even just being wrinkled and stuff is great I, that's what i do like that's what i like you know but too i don't you know matter to me i just throwing on stuff like i just you know and so um sometimes again I say sometimes you're throwing on stuff, sometimes I'm thinking about it, and um, and other times I'm just being really funny and cool, you know what I'm saying? Which is all the time. And so these ones is, these ones is Zara, Z A R A, them khaki slacky things. And this one is, uh, this one is W A I. M E A Way Me I don't know. <laughs> it got on the it got on the bucket <laughs> it got on the button too. And so I like the pants, you know, they got the you know all this extra stuff. I like that a lot too, just as much as I like the plain solid ones. And so I like these ones. And these is a size, I really always wear a size 28 for the most part. I wear a 28, that's my favorite because it's like not small or big for me. And sometimes I'm getting to like, I don't really don't know if it really goes smaller than 28, but um, I go all the way to 24, I mean, I go all the way to 34 as far as the pants goes because I like baggy pants too. But the 28, they fit for real. They like fit it, you know. And so that's my favorite go-to in like the straight leg jeans. But I like skinny jeans. I like all type of stuff. I like all the, the fashion that we got, right? So now that we say that, um, we uh, showed this shoe like 20,000 times. I dancing these shoes these are my go-to shoes that i've danced in a lot because these ones sometimes you know like these shoes i got on these ones i got a lot of room in them these ones i kind of got a lot of room like they kind of snub so i kind of i had to you know what i'm saying but get these ones <laughs> back in the you know what i'm saying a few years ago i had twenty thousand shoes and I could fit them all. Now it's like, man, I'm being able to fit the shoes for like a couple of months and then it's like, man, but, so you still, people, we all still growing as far as the growth spurts and stuff. And so, um, I could fit these, but I, I dance in them so that I can still break them in. And so these is really, I like these ones. And so, 
them right here, I got a lot of room in those ones too. And so some shoes just got a lot of room in, like these ones, I got a lot of room in these ones. But I can't wear these outside all the time because I'll be clicking, you know what I'm saying? And so, uh, because these is actually cleats, but I do wear them for fashion. But if I don't want to be all loud, you know what I'm saying, walking around, <laughs> which I do, uh, it just, uh, that'd be funny and cool. People like, you got on cleats, that's what's up. And so uh, that's cool that I like to wear cleats just to be fun. And we like to wear cleats. We like to, I mean, literally, me, I like to wear it for fashion too, outside of playing soccer, which I play, you know what I'm saying? But same where, you know what I'm saying? These, um, I really like play soccer when I'm playing basketball. So obviously, like, I'll be barefooted when I'm playing most of the time, either sports, you know what I'm saying? But when I like go to the, you know, place to go play or when I go outside or whatever, you know, Cape Mirror, I would have, you know what I'm saying? These same old shoes, I always wear the same shoes. Like, even if I have, even back then when I had 20,000 shoes, it'd be like them go-to shoes and then all of a sudden you wanna bring them ones out, you know what I'm saying? That you don't want to get dirty or you know, and then the other ones just like, these ones ain't gonna get dirty, these ones, you know, sturdy. So these is kind of like them ones, and they black too. So these are my go-to shoes right here. And so these past, you know, three recent musical interview thingy, just chilling sessions. Cause I got like concerts out there where I'm just, this is about music or I'm just performing on the stage and stuff. and and things like that everywhere and in in you know you know what I'm saying so these times right here where I'm really just talking and you know sharing my behind the scene character um I do that sometimes and so uh more and more is getting to you know the friends and so as we be friends all this you know what I'm saying uh speaking I like to do uh, I say I'm an influential speaker and talker speecher and you know sometimes I just steer off and just just be you know what I'm saying just talking talking to you communicating being communicative and, and things like that things of the sort so sorting off this stuff while talking to talking to y'all talking to you so uh, that's what I, I enjoy to do we is the joy we the joyous and uh, you know I always go back to, you know what I'm saying, speaking like that because that's who I am. You know, even even partners, you know, go get the partners, partners come get me or we meeting up, whatever, we, we meeting for the first time too, something. I always, you know what I'm saying, am the quiet one. I'm actually quiet. And so I'm always the one, you know, saying some, you know, motivational, positive things and I got the ear for that. and when the folks be talking, you know, that's when I'm zooming in. But I really am a zoned out person. Like, I'm real quiet, I'll be like zoned out, even doing this. I don't even remember half the stuff I just said already. But I know, you know, how I am, the way I spiral into being me, you know what I'm saying? And so, again, half of these things I did already show, and so, uh, and then, right now, Part three, I'm prolonging on showing stuff because I kind of showed a lot and all the good stuff I already showed. <laughs> this stuff good too, you know what I'm saying? But you guys are watching number one and two to get, you know, a feel view of what I really like to wear and stuff because I was matching and you know how you sometimes you just get stuff and all of a sudden you match it when you get to the, back to the spot. I was kind of doing that on camera or you went someplace and you got it and they were already matched. It was the outfit that I showed all that already. And so now it's just like random little knickknacks that I like to just throw on or, you know, big stuff that I got to find the thing that went with it. You know what I'm saying? So this is just funny now. So I actually want to show this stuff, but you know. <laughs> all right, so. <laughs> I wore this. <laughs> I like them. So this is another thermal. And this got this on it. And I, I like this a lot because it's like, no matter what, you know, I wore this thousands of times and it's still kind of crisp. 
it's not like that. It's kind of heavy and all that. And this right here is like thick and stuff. So no matter how much times I have wore it, this is what happened. And it's still like something I would, you know, go to, you know. And so, uh, and then things like this. I wrote my name on this one. And uh, this one's from H&M. And... There was some shorts that I that I just had. Oh, some swim shorts. These some swim shorts. These from H and M too. These from H and M too. They swim shorts. And it's so uh, this shirt from H and M. And I had showed um, you know, I sold that jacket back there. <laughs> That's an H and M. I sold that one twenty a times, all the time. So I showed this one's from H and M too, and then we got this one. I like this one a lot too because it's like silky, and it's like a little like you know they both you know this is heavy too. It's just like this one more stiff. This one like shiny, and I like how it got like I don't know like yesterday I said it got it got like stuff on the pocket. That on the pocket. This is all right. So I got like I'll stay like two other H and M shorts and like a couple more H and M shirts. It's so um. My other favorite jacket back there is American Eagle. It's a pea coat and I like it. I wear it all the time. The other one is True Religion. I wear that all the time. And so as we talk about winter, the summer is getting here. And so um, I still show the, the summer stuff too. Um, and so um, this one of the smallest jackets that I got. <laughs> and I like it, like, I haven't worn it. It's actually new, I haven't worn it. It's from 90 degree. It's from 90 degree and it's gonna fit like real snug. And I'ma like it. Obviously I'ma wear it without, um, I'ma wear it without the, the hoodie on the, on the, on the, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna show you some more small, small stuff that I like to wear. Art. So, I showed these yesterday. <laughs> I showed this yesterday, and this is pajamas. <laughs> this pajamas right here. <laughs> it's um, I said this is small. This is, <laughs> and I wear. So I'm gonna wear a regular t-shirt underneath uh, these small shirts right there. And I'm gonna actually wear like some shorts, like some basketball shorts um, under over this, which I got a lot of basketball shorts that I'll wear. And I'll wear these under there too. And I wore these playing basketball not too long ago. SDM, SDMN, and um, I'll wear these under my, um, 
I'll wear this stuff like this. I got some Nike ones like this too. I'm gonna show soon. And so uh, I'll wear them under my basketball shorts. I'll share more of my basketball shorts or my swimming sh trunks or something. Cause I'll be, I say, you know, I'm about to go swimming and go play basketball, and I like wear swimming trunks instead of basketball shorts sometimes when I'm playing basketball or soccer and stuff. And with soccer uh, shorts and, and baseball stuff, and so I um uh, sometimes be doing that, putting it all together, cause I know I'm about to do all that one day or something. I did this, I painted it. <laughs> this is one of my more funny ones. And so when I take stuff serious, I just you know threw this together. I threw the paint literally. I threw the paint like like this on the shirt. But before I did that, this was my very like it was a nice shirt, but I like this shirt. It goes with some pants that I actually painted back there. This shirt, this big old shirt, is from um standard. And so it's not that big, but it is. And so, um, on me it'll be big, and so I like that. This just a, a regular shirt, and so this a regular shirt, and so I'll be just stepping the regular shirts too. I'll wear a regular shirt, put a jacket on, or a regular shirt, and just be gone. This was um. 32 cool 32 cool This one extra large too uh, This I wore this yesterday With these right here these Timberlands right here, I wore this yesterday with it, and this is, uh, Sheen, and that's in the large, and when I'm covering stuff, is this because I'm trying to, like, underline the main word, the main thing, it's, uh, and I like that, uh, the buttons went with this, the buttons went with this, This is uh this one um it's a paper denim and cloth. <laughs> this one of my small shirts that I like. I wore this uh this uh one of the regular black small shirts I like and I'll probably just want to wear this regular together <laughs> yeah I would have wear it together man <laughs> because I like to just wear or I probably would have threw this on over it and I got one that's smaller than this but I wrote on that I painted on that one and so I like regular you know what I'm saying stuff too uh, just to like So it got this on the hood, I like that. So that's cool. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It says Marine University in Indianapolis. It says one super duper modern classic super. Oh, I don't know what this. Sydney, New York, Tokyo, Paris. One by um by um. It's in cursive, so it's kind of hard to read. So, but. One, Stony, New York, Tokyo, Paris. 
And I like these. I got one on the button right there. This is a regular shirt right here. A lot of times I just be wearing regular uh, stuff. I mean like, it ain't even regular either because that's kind of silky a little bit. This one kind of silky a little bit. And so I'm selling all the stuff that don't got nothing on it today. There's lots of stuff back here too that I'll show that got stuff today. Um, we go ahead, you know, um, I probably would have wore this under there to complement the, uh, and so I was doing what I would wear together on number one and two and things that came together on one and two and we'll try to do that now too. But there's more stuff there, there, and, and um, It'd probably be a part four, but these <laughs> I'll marry these right here. I mean, you know, uh, the design and stuff. I made these, and oh, uh, I like that the pocket is red. I made this shirt. This from H and M. Well, you know, I made it, I painted it and stuff. And matter of fact, some of it was already, you know, tie-dye. This is a tie-dye shirt already. I just, like, painted it more. I haven't even worn this yet. Look how wrinkled it is. <laughs> I never wore this yet, man. And so this, I would wear, like, like a regular t-shirt like a polo window under here that's why i've got lots of under shirts too because some of my shirts be, it would fit it which i like because it like fits for real but sometimes like you know it's shorter so that'd be cool you know what I'm saying? i made this one i like thermals <laughs> i said that 10 times i said it 20 times i'll put it right on this one too and so, uh, this is thermal. I did this. This is my favorite. This is my favorite thermal because it fit for real. And it's like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is L-E-E. -E. This is Lee, this jacket Lee right here, and it say it on the, L-E-E. -E. This one of the smallest jean jackets that I got. I really like jean jackets. Well, actually I got like two other small ones too. Yeah, I said I like wearing jean jackets with sweats too. And this is what I mean. I would have wore this with this because today, this sweatsuit right here is smaller fit. I like, you know, baggy ones too. And so this one of the smaller ones, I got like a sweatsuit that's a little smaller than this one too. And so I mentioned how, you know, the sizes vary and fluctuate and depending on what you're doing. So if I go like this and all that in a music video, I'm like, yeah, I could feel where I'm at. And then I would like all of a sudden you want to go everywhere. And so jackets get, you know, thrown around. So that's all that stuff I'll wrinkle too, is I'm dancing a lot of the time and moving the material around and, you know what I'm saying, and dancing with it. And so, yeah. I will wear this. <laughs> I'll wear this a few times on uh, uh, one or two of my videos, three of my videos. And uh, I like this. I always I always got these since I was young, uh, you know what I'm saying? Since I was, you know, finding these when I could find them. So they be in the store sometimes. And I like to wear, you know, I would have worn them Jordan I would have worn them Jordans with these. I always wear Jordans with these things because 
I don't know, I'll just be like it. I'll wear this outside before, bro. <laughs> I'll put this on in the store. Out of everything in the in the store that I like to try on, I always try these on. All the time, every time. And uh and I'll be dancing in the mirror being all you know funny and so uh, <laughs> And so I like to, you know, do that. I'll be always, you know, a goofball in, in everywhere really. If I'm not super, super quiet, I'm just like in my own world doing, you know, just, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Alright, so this is, um, St. St. John's Bay. Jones or John's? Day. Believe it or not, I'm a really good reader. I've been stumbling, I've been <laughs> trying to get these, you know, pronunciations all of a sudden it seems like you know wow you can't even but but I can't sometimes you know and, and, and that's cool because language is, is good in, in general but for the most part I'll, I know how to read really good but <laughs> this is honest um this is register JS Trigger St. John's Bay I don't know, but this is one of my smallest thermals, and this one is, um, <laughs> that was real nice, <laughs> yeah, man, no, because I wear this all the time, <laughs> I wore this one time, okay, <laughs> But I'm saying I would wear this again and again when I get a chance. <laughs> but the habit, just the habit, you know, because sometimes I do want to be fitted, so I would wear, you know, probably a a, a thermal under it this way, because it's a bigger thermal under this or like a shirt, because I want to sometimes, you know, what I'm saying, and sometimes I just want to be baggy, you know, what I'm saying so. Yeah. This is one of the regular ones. This one of the regular ones. This is um Anvil. A N V I L. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> I was supposed to be putting stuff in there, but you know. This one is <laughs> okay, this one's Brooklyn Brooklyn Standard. Okay, that one Brooklyn Standard. I uh, literally <laughs> This one is Monterey Club. This is Monterey Club, M-O-N-T-E-R-E-Y, club, see, um, that's like, you know, golf club, and so, I got a lot of golfing gear, like this right here, and I said, you know, you know, uh, when I wear my hats, they be like, hanging off and stuff, but if I do like, decide to put it on, um, it rarely still be on because my hair, but it's so, uh, I like hats though, like, I like hats though, I've always liked hats, and so, um, it's actually go. so, with that being said, um, uh, got this, I got a shirt that goes with this, and I got a lot of hats. And so we got this. I paid it on this too, but this was already there. And I got this actually. This is 
Apex Gold exclusive. This extra large. I wore this together. I wore this on my music video. I wore this a lot. I wore this a lot of times on lots of my music videos with different type of uh, pants and different type of jackets and just by itself and with some shorts or anything. Uh, I wore this a lot. I wore this to go play sports. I wore this to play. I wore this for the photo shoot. <laughs> I wore this a lot, man. And, um, I'll even wear this with some jeans. I'll even wear this. I'll wear these, I think. I wore this with it. And so I did wear that with it. And what shoes I wore, uh, when I find them shoes that I wore, I'm gonna show you. And these is, uh, what I show these ones? This is a, a original denim, original vintage denim. This is a size 30. And so that's what I mean by I wear, I wear, I really wear a 28, but I wear 30s all the way up to 36. I wear, I even got some pants that's 40. And so, um, but my belt be real tight. And so it don't really look that big, but it look, you know, good to dance and stuff and move around. Sometimes I need some room, and so I'll be wearing bigger jeans, and sometimes I just want to be fitted, and uh, I can move around like that sometimes, depends on what it is. And so, my alternative, I went to these because, again, I could kind of put it on. The other hats I can't because all uh, my hair is set up. So I like these, these are what I'm talking about. <laughs> the visors, I always like visors in the first place too. I made this one. When I find the big old thermal that I have, I have, I made a, I made this outfit, right? And, um, when I could find the big old thermal that I wore, I wore this on the video too, that I got. Okay, the shirt, <laughs> I did excellent on the shirt for real. Alright, so when I find that very nice big old nice thermal that I did to go with this, I put it on this shirt. And then I have paint and boots that I, I wore with these two. I'll wear I'll put that on the I'll show you on that too. Always like this. And all type of different ones like this. And this one is uh, Air Apostle. I think you got the polo ones, the rough one ones. And so this one of the fitted ones. Ones 
I'll roll on the butt. <laughs> I'll roll on, on the the artboards a lot too. And so I made these, y'all. I made these too. I mean, you know, I painted them and stuff. Yeah, um, I I painted an outfit to go with these. A few outfits to go with these. I gotta find that. And so they, they don't really particularly go with this outfit that I made, but I will find that and put it on there. Put it on here. Baseball uh, pants. This one, <laughs> I got this. I'll be using this for the background. I'll be using this for the background. And so I only use this for the background twice. But I got a lot of things that I do use for the background, like a lot of stuff that I do use for the background. And so other than the things I like to wear also, what I like to do, like I use this for the background too. I don't want like the objects in the you know in the background. I would like use some stuff. And so that's what I like to do. Like I say, I produce and all that and direct the stuff. And I got the eye for we got the eye for stuff. And so I'll be always setting up. You know, even out there, wherever here. This is uh, actually my house, but I'll be doing all type of stuff, musicals and all that. And, the productions it happens here bro but it be like all over around you know what I'm saying but right now here and I place all stuff and stuff on the ground too so I got this one I use for the background too So that's the, so you know, when I do set up, a lot of times it'd be, <laughs> it'd be falling like you did, so I'll just use this or something, but, or, you know, different types of things in the furniture and itself around the spot. Um, I like to, like, cover up sometimes so I can, like, you know, stiffy it up within the production and incorporation of the music and stuff. And so uh, I'll be using things like that and stuff. Yeah, this one. And I got all type of art that I did that I'll use for the background too. So this one, uh, we got this one. It's like sway, you can use it on a uh, different way. <laughs> you can use it on a different way. Alright, so you got this one. It's sway and then it's like shiny gold. This one is silver. Uh, the other side is actually 
solid, so that's cool. And then here I got this one. I got this one. And they all different material, they all different, so that's cool. And then you got this swing, and this will really like this so I kinda put this on the ground and used it as like a magic carpet and I was like you know, talking about the planets and rapping and singing, playing guitar on that. You can find that that video somewhere. And there's another one where it's in the background. And uh, I have put, no, actually, uh, anyway, so. The same with this. I put this in the background plenty of times. I even put this on the floor too. And I like set up on there. But other than that, I had got, uh, Let me see. I'm looking for stuff. Oh, there yeah, this. I use this a lot of the times. And I call this the puzzle pieces. Because you gotta, you know, put it together. I, I put this on the ground a lot of times. Or I just work out on it, you know what I'm saying? So I'll be doing like workouts with Ray. And so this goes a long way. This is like, after you put it together and all that. I haven't really particularly used it as a background, but I did place it on the ground. I think it's for the ground. So when I'm stumping around dancing in the house, I'll put this down. But I do got uh, the black one, this one. So I use all types of different stuff, and I also like the carpets and stuff. And so I will put these together, place it on the ground so I can jump around, stump around hard, you know what I'm saying? And, um, so I did that a lot. I got some lots of musicals. And so I do direct and produce my own videos and I set up and all that and stuff like that. And and I have them close. Really number part one and two, you can see what I really wear on my videos and stuff. Again, right now with slight wear, but it was nice, it's nice stuff also. And so if I can find my one jeans, I've been trying to put a stuff that I haven't like some of that stuff I've been wanting to show too. It's just I couldn't show it in part one. It too and so uh that stuff really nice too and i like it and i showed it i'm happy about it we'll go to a part you know full and all that and all that all type of stuff and art things around that i'm gonna you know grab and show and all that Those all type of these that I got around that I could put that's not even nothing in there yet and uh I gotta organize I said I gotta organize all this stuff. There's little knickknacks and stuff that I do have that I you know all type of art things, art gallery, uh, the, the galaxy of art is where we at, all of us. So I get on there and talk about that and I'll rap about it and stuff like that. And I'll even show. <laughs> See, these stuff, these things is like empty for the most part. Like all this stuff, these, a lot of this stuff is empty. I'll stay here, I'll take stuff, all the, uh. And so this is. American Tourister. Uh, this is one of my suitcases. I really like these, my ponchos, these, uh, the pearl, uh, what's this one? I really like these, I always really like these, um, and so, uh, they is really, I like this, 
so I got a few on them and I done you know a lot of production in these right here because I like it you know I done uh, things in this it's one of my tight fitted hoodies and my name on there this one I painted this one It say Ray on the back of it. I got some jeans that go to this construction. This Air Apostle, this is one of my other life. So the Nike shoes that I just had up here, I'll be wearing that with this. This air apostle and so uh, a light air apostle. How do you? How do you like air apostle? Air apostle. I sell three thousand at a time. I like this because it's solid black and um, um I gotta hang a lot of this up stuff up too. I really like the things that got like, you know what I'm saying, this on it, this type of uh, thing. I got this chair. <laughs> I got this rolling chair. I got this <laughs> I got this skateboard. I painted this skateboard. Well, I painted this part. I'ma paint this part. The other part when I when I get a chance. When I um when I actually my actual skateboard skateboard when I find it it's around here somewhere. I, I, I actually like it. Uh, and I ain't painting that one. I mean, I like that one too, but... I've always been a skater. My first, first performance was at three years old. And it was all my siblings and cousins. We was... We all there, we all siblings and cousins, you know? And so my immediate siblings and cousins, we always went skating. And so when I was three, and we always rapping and singing, and so when I was three, we ended up performing on my birthday. Cause me and my cousins got the same birthday, and um, like two of my cousins got this, like, like four of my cousins got birthday two days before me or two days behind and we like, one year, two year apart or something. We used to go skating so we performed um, at three and that's when I start performing at three. I've been performing ever since. I've always been a dancer and a model and uh, but when I first did that one performance for the first time I was rapping and singing and skating and stuff. And uh, everybody, you know, gathered around. It was a real performance there but it was actually my birthday too. It was our birthday. And then I, I, I started modeling at three. And then I started dancing in a dance class for a year at five. And so I, uh, I remember a few of them dances, but not too much, but I do uh, do them dances sometimes. And uh, I like to uh, grab dances I've never seen before. I like to make up dances. And um, I like to make up dancing and stuff. So skating has been a very fundamental fun thing for me. I talked about the skate. I went to the skating ring, the ice skating ring. And my first time at the ice skating ring, I was uh, eight years old. First time in me skating, remember me skating was at three years old. 
and we was performing at those at those times, you know. When we go like to amusement parks and stuff, we was performing like if I do a modeling gig and stuff at five, we would go to like Great America, Six Flags and things like that. And so that general area is where I'm like originated from, you know, um and so Six Flags, um we all uh, went every day, you know, we had season passes and stuff and then I started going to Great America about when I joined that modeling agency when I was five. And so we had to see the passes every year. And I am, that was, an, um, I don't really mention that a lot, but um, yeah. So that's why I like the, uh, the animal lions a lot too, because around that time, that's when um, I would visit the lions at the amusement park. It was my favorite. That was my favorite. You know, I like the rides and stuff. So I mentioned the rides and all that too, because in my actual city that I actually originated from, Vallejo, California, I um in that actual area, that's where we was placed at. You know, what I'm saying the place was got all you all was uh, IB and stuff. And so that's what was called Marine World back then. Right now it's called Six Flags, but before that it was. Uh, Discovery Kingdom, so it was Marine World, it changed to Discovery Kingdom, then it changed to Six Flags, and so um, I can't wait to get back there to perform. Um, I always got laid on the rides, even when I was, I mean, I was, I was always, you know, right, you know, small, I was always small, too small to get on the rides, but for some reason, like, I had to wear the shoes that, you know, I could, like, be so, <laughs> I don't know, but, um, I was able to get on the rides and stuff, but so I always like the rides. And so, um, being that I am, you know, an adult and stuff, and you know, I shout out to you know the youthful things, and we are youthful, and we got it full of life, and you know what I'm saying, and things that, and I, I talk about the things that I was doing, that was fun, you know. I, bought, I started basketball at three. Um, I started baseball at eight, I started soccer at nine, and I started swimming, swimming, swimming. I started swimming, swimming at like eight. And I started music at like, again, like one, but when I started freestyling, freestyling, I was five. But me performing and stuff and trying to grasp, you know, the, the songs that my cousins was doing, that was my age. And, and, uh, and, and all the friends and stuff, and, and the songs that I would find myself. You know, being a unit as, you know, we kicking it, you know, as little kids and stuff, and performing together and separately. So I've always been a solo artist, but I always, you know, perform with others too. And so uh, I'll talk about that that stuff and stuff like that. I played, I played this. All right, so. I play this, but I'm not, you know, I gotta be, I'm doing other stuff, but um, you can find that online and stuff, but for the most part, I really like the sticks because, so with this, is all about the rhythm, with the guitar, you know, I'm a guitarist, but I am a bungle player too, which is the drum bungles. rhythm 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 and with the guitar it's like it's rhythm but it's electric and all that so this really is good on the beat you know what I'm saying so I'm happy I got this and so usually I use the drumsticks because I never seen nobody do that with the actual bungles it's always like the drum and stuff so I kind of like put my twist to it that I like that and I like the sound and you know I like the guitar with this and so the beats be coming out good I'll make the beats and I also you know do the little tickings and stuff that I find that's you know automotive on the uh, electronic and I'll, I'll make me a beat you know what I'm saying and I also piano so when I say I make the beats with the tickings and all that with the automotives you know I um you know the, the rhythm I put the rhythm together you know what I'm saying so I am the rhythmist, I am the rhymist, I am the music bliss, blast that we have as doing whatever we like to do. So uh, 
this is a, a light this right here. And there's another drum drum thing back over there and wherever, wherever everywhere that I put on the beat, but I made these right here. I painted them, I mean. These is uh, forward denim. I made these here right here. I think I'll word this with a uh, this. Or and I'll wear it with some other stuff too that it was like. my snow pants. I got like some gray ones too. Alright so we gonna uh, these is called you got an R right there. I like that a lot. It said um international boarding company and um it says rip zone um yeah got an R on the pocket, I like that, you know, the R on the pocket, so I'm ready, so I like, you know, when things say ready, and when things say the R and stuff, we got this, this is one of my favorite sweaters, because I like, you know, I like, I like all of the stuff too, though, I like it because it go with these. I like what stuff you go like, well, I got a video, I got a few videos and stuff I, uh, I did uh, with this, and I would wear, you know, I like to wear solid white with stuff that the white just be, you know what I'm saying, just like this, like I would wear, cause I, um, I would wear, you know, I got a shirt that goes, it's black white, you go with this and, Usually, you know, um, but I like that this part is complimenting the white, you know, and you know what I'm saying? So I will wear them. And so sometimes I like to mix and match and stuff. I showed them shirt and stuff the other day. And I wore this on a photo shoot. This actually, and this is Adidas. I like the word it zipped up because what it got, it got on a uh, picture, some art on it. And I got some pants to this too. All right, so this is gonna be another part, y'all. It's gonna be another part, y'all. And, um, there's a uh, there's gonna be a few more parts of, of, the, of the, the musical ear relief. So I got this, and this thing uh, it got light on it. It got lights on it. Okay, maybe it, okay. It did have lights on it when I first. <laughs> I let it sit around. So. All right, so. Uh, so I usually ride this one because that handle, uh, I mean, obviously, uh, this one, I don't know this one. I think you gotta be here, yeah, you gotta be rolling, that's what it is. So they both light up and stuff, and um, I'm gonna, um, I always talk about these knickknacks and stuff. Yeah, uh, that one ain't, you know, this one's sturdier. <laughs> but, this one's 32, I just, I lost that screw, I was really kicking, I was gone, you know, I was gone, and so, that's what happened, and so, um, and this is Jetson, this Jet, these are Jetson, alright, and so, um, there's more, we'll do more, and, um, 
part is really hard to watch, y'all. So we gonna do some more uh, of what we been doing. All right, yeah. <laughs> And so I do little commercial like, you know what I'm saying, quotes and stuff. You be like, I mean, you was over there in the zone. And you are, you know what I'm saying, all of a sudden. <laughs> I, 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 I'm funny, bro. Alright, John. <laughs> I'm gonna get up out of here, y'all. You know. Uh, until next time, y'all. Alright, so we all the captain, we all the pilot, we all is the generals. You know, as far as you know, generally speaking, as far as being, you know, what I'm saying. Um, again, being um, uh, festy with the festivities of the um, influential dancing, singing, rapping parties. You know what I'm saying? Fun slay. And I say, hey, what a day, what good days that we do like to play with the PlayStation of the, um, I like, you know, say, play the Xbox a lot. And so that's what I'll be talking about to speak a lot. And I'll be doing music for show, you know, like the robot. Then again, I'm talking about the Avatar Dead Two of y'all here, Shine and Sprout. Y'all mean, you know what we be about? Very hard it was.